Gibbs White takes it deep towards the back post. Bolly nods it across and then headed in from close range by Yates. The man who won the free kick was on the end of it eventually. A stooping header from inside the six yard box. No goal. A VAR break goes the way of the Cherries. Is that the first time ever? Well, the celebrations around the Vitality Stadium will tell you that it probably does feel like the first time ever. Quick one taken by Anthony, very alert. Down the left-hand side for Zamora. Early cross, Kiefer Moore! Oh, what a blazing miss from Kiefer Moore. You don't get better service than that as a centre-forward. John Zamora's cross, pinpoint onto the head of Kiefer Moore. Dead centre, around the six-yard line. Up towards Wataru, flicks it on for Kiefer Moore. They exchange headers and then Wataru nods it on on the outside of Lodi. First chance we've really seen to see his pace and he plays it into Jaden Anthony. Oh, brilliant! Absolutely brilliant! An assist in the first half of his first game in the Premier League for Dungo Wataru as he squares it across the box and Jaden Anthony picks up where he left off. The scorer of Bournemouth's last Premier League goal way back in November is on target again. Well, that's a great little flick, and now Anthony might be away down the left-hand side. Cherry's trying to get numbers forward here. Bolly comes across, you've got Matara at the back post. If Anthony gets his head up, Zamora drives it across, and then Lodi, oh goodness me, from the six-yard box. He nearly cleared it straight into the path of Watara, who was coming in at the back post, but Forrest managed to sneak it behind for a corner. Well, that was magnificent work by the Forrest defender to just to get a foot on it. He's, just, he's literally there waiting for the tapping, and... Danilo completely mistimed his jump there with no one around him and then Kiefer Moore gives it straight back to Gibbs White and over the top from Brennan Johnson who puts it across goal and slid in by Surridge and there is no flag and of all the people to break Bournemouth hearts it's Sam Surridge their former striker who puts the ball under his arm doesn't celebrate races back to halfway there may be no saviour from VAR this time Bournemouth 1 Nottingham Forest 1